Last week we had Saturday Rough Seas, but Operation Real Heroes was a huge success. So many memories created. Special thanks to Patrick and Summer for putting the whole thing together and all the sponsors. You know, you should reach out for next year if you got a boat and get involved. This is a great way to give back to our uh, wounded warriors and really give a kudos to those military people and let them know that we love them and they're very special to us. God bless America and God bless our veterans. Now on to the week that we're going to have fishing. It's fantastic. So far we've been seeing the resurgence of bluefish. They're still here. They should be spawning. So I would be looking for bluefish coming in and out of the harbor depending on what waves of bait are coming in. Right now we've got butterfish on the outside, we have bunker on the outside, and uh, now we're start, gonna start seeing peanut bunker emerge in the back harbors along with lots of spearing. The off the moon hatch, so I wouldn't expect to see any type of cinder worm hatch or a, a shrimp hatch or anything, or a sand eel hatch just right now. We're in between the moon phases, but the water temps are still keeping down. They're staying cool because of this weather that we've had. You know, there's a lot of strange winds going on, so you have to pick your moments and keep your eye on those weather forecasts. They're really, really important. Another point out of safety is that, you know, we're seeing a lot of people out there without PFDs and not really understanding the current. If you're on a boat and you're on anchor, please be aware of the currents if you decide to have a guest or yourself jump off the boat and uh, swim around. You might want to have a tethered rope to yourself, stay out of a channel. You don't want to go swimming in a channel, but we're seeing it up here and we really don't want to see any accidents. Every life is very precious. And uh, so if you see something, you see a friend, you know, don't be afraid to, to speak up and do it politely, of course. And uh, as far as the beach scene goes, those piping plovers, you know, they're really upsetting a lot of people. They're wrecking the access. Piping plover issue really has got to be dealt with because I almost feel like um, there is such a crushing suppression on the surf casting community after we buy all of these expensive uh, access passes for vehicles and you follow the rules and people are doing really good and then the powers to be decide to shut the whole place down. It's really cruel and it's not fair to a lot of people, even the ones that are practicing conservation and don't want to see these birds get hit. Um, we got to do something. It's definitely something that needs to be addressed. As far as uh, the fishing, we've got sea bass opening up here. Uh, the bluefish are here. They're spawning out in the sound right now. So don't expect them to go anywhere. They're here to stay and they're beautiful when you can get involved with them. We've got plenty of striped bass. The chunking is red hot. The trolling is red hot. Jigging is red hot. If you can find the bass, you know, they are, they're tricky sometimes. Uh, it seems like they have locked jaw and then all of a sudden a switch on, it's like the bite's on for a good hour, two hours, and it's you're getting some quality fish. Practice those catch and release. If you have any questions, definitely reach out and ask because we're here for you all the time. We know this recession hurts, you know, and gas costs a lot. That's why at Cal Harbor, we always have customer loyalty points. When you come here and you buy, you enter the customer loyalty points program, it's absolutely free. And uh, as you earn your points, you get store credit back and you absolutely can apply that to whatever purchase you like. Doesn't matter whether it's on sale, we don't get into a whole list of exclusions. You spend your money, our family business is so appreciative, we wanna give some back. You know, it's always great speaking with everybody and hearing all the feedback and the wonderful comments from these reports. I totally value them and I wanna say thank you so much. Till next week, I bid you all peace and tight lines.